In John chapter 2, Jesus performed his first miracle at a wedding at Cana in Galilee. And this is where he turned water into wine. Now, all of this started when the mother of Jesus, who was also present at the wedding, once they knew that the wine had run out, made this statement to the servants who were there at the wedding feast. She said in John 2 and verse 5, Whatever he says to you, do it. Now, she may not have known what Jesus was about to do, but she believed he had the power to do something to fix that situation. So she told the servants, whatever he says, you do it. And what he ended up telling them to do was to fill the water pots full with water, then take some of that and take it to the head waiter. None of that would have made any sense for the servants why they would do that. But it didn't matter if it made sense to them. Jesus said, this is what you do. So they did it. The result was a remarkable miracle. The reputation of the family was preserved, and it was the beginning of the signs that he performed while here on the earth. This principle applies for us today. When we think about what he has called us to do to follow him, the same principle is for us. Whatever he says, do it. When we read instructions in the scriptures about what we are to do or how he expects us to conduct ourselves or certain things we are to avoid, it doesn't always matter whether it makes sense to us or not. We might think that, well, that's different than what I've always believed or different from what I've always done, or I don't really understand why God would want me to do things this way or do this rather than that. Really, it doesn't matter what we think. It doesn't matter what makes sense to us. We just simply need to do what he has instructed us to do. So as we approach the word of God in everything that we do, let's not think, well, does this make sense for me to do this? Instead, we should just be asking, is this what the Lord has instructed? And whatever he says, whatever his word instructs us to do, let's make the commitment that that's what we're going to do.